If you own an electric car and are curious to know how much battery does it consume when you go for a vacation, uh, for a week, for a month, more or less. Um, so I'm going to do a test with the Model S, leave it for a week, uh, charge it up to 90% and see how much battery does it consume while it's on idle. This video is mainly focused for those who do not have a home charger. If you do have, just plug it in and it should be fine. That's the best way to keep your battery healthy. You don't want the battery to get drained while you're away. And for those who do not have a home charger, there are a few features that you should switch off if you do not need it. For example, the sentry mode, that's gonna drain a lot. So if you live in a safe neighborhood, keep it off. Second thing was gonna be the in-cabin heat protection. So I'm just gonna go quickly on the settings and show you exactly what to keep on and what to switch off. So when you're on the main menu, click on safety. You're going to see sentry mode this is going to be the most draining feature while you're on vacation or away from the car i recommend switching it off keep in mind even if you keep it on if you live in a unsafe neighborhood as you can see you can pause the video here and read all the features about it so once it, it reaches 20 percent this feature will automatically switch off to preserve battery. But I always keep camera-based detection on and the view live through the camera app. Just in case when I'm away, I would like to have a look around the car, look around the car through the built-in cameras. Next thing I would switch off is the cabin overheat protection. So if you park your car in the sun, especially if you live in a hot weather, like here in the Middle East, you could keep it on, but keep in mind this also does drain battery. Same thing as the sentry mode, as soon as your battery reaches 20%, this feature will also automatically switch off. So let's see, I'm gonna keep this car parked and see how much battery it's gonna drain. So you can see at the moment I have 90% battery and it's the 25th of, hold on, let me get the focus. Yeah, it's 25th of August right now. So you're gonna check within a week how much battery it's gonna consume. It's definitely been a long time I didn't drive the car. As you can see, I left it for 30 days just to see how much battery it has consumed. So let's see. 75% since last time I charged to 90% 30 days ago, which is not bad. So you can see the only feature that was kept on for the past 30 days was the camera-based detection and the live camera via mobile app. You can have these switched off and I think you would even save more battery. Uh, just follow the steps that I mentioned at the beginning of this video. That would be your best way to preserve as much as battery as you can while you're on vacation or if you have to leave your car unplugged for a long period of time. Uh, hope you found this video useful. Like, subscribe, and uh, there's a drag race event coming up, I believe from a week from now. And I'll be taking the Model S and the Model X Plaids to the drag race event to compete against uh, all the other cars that are attending the uh, drag race event. So yeah, see you in the next one.